The overall goal of this procedure is to enable localized control over neuroplastic mechanisms in the human brain using neurofeedback from real-time functional magnetic resonance imaging. Neurofeedback training holds the potential to combat neurologic disorders of the brain by altering synaptic potentials in target brain regions without the use of pharmaceutical drugs or invasive surgical intervention. The main advantage of this technique is that subjects can learn to endogenously alter localized brain activity in a systematic way. The strategies used for altering the localized brain activity can be translated to ubiquitous platforms such as smartphones, tablets, to enable simple at-home solution. Abnormal synaptic potentials and brain connectivity are associated with many neurologic disorders, including autism, traumatic brain injury, Parkinson's disease, and vestibular disorders. The feedback is based on hemodynamic changes associated with neuronal activity, and thus has poor temporal resolution, making training more difficult for some subjects. Because hyperactivity of brain regions is often a finding in patients with tinnitus, this approach is aimed at teaching subjects to down-regulate activity in regions of interest. Begin by connecting the TR trigger output from the Magnetic Resonance Imaging, or MRI machine, to the Stimulus PC. Then position the MR-compatible display so that it will be visible to the participant via the mirror affixed to the head coil. Next, have the participant lie down in a supine position on the scanner table. Place the headphones on the participant's head and ensure the ears are covered.